Um, we put Kenneth Salmer on the front page of Wednesday, the day of our digital relaunch. And Fraser Nelson from the Spectator said that um, well, you've obviously called it, you obviously you've, you've turned it left. <laughs> I said, well, we, we weren't the people having a party in Liverpool during the, the Labour Party um, um, conference last week. So um, we're a year away from the general election, I think, um, and all the smart money currently, presently, is on the Labour Party. But uh, as I wrote today, uh, if, a, if, if a week is a long time in politics, a year is a lifetime. And um, he's got to hold that um, Ming vase for, for a year without dropping it. His arms appeal is a result of many, many different things. But I think the fact that he looks steadfast is probably um, something that um, people uh, find appealing. Um, personality politics have wrecked um, um, British politics and American politics in the last few years. And what about housing and young people within <coughs> London? Is that going to be, do you think there'll be a bigger turnout with young people? Or how do we solve that, that problem? Because you're employing well, I think, I think young people, um, to use your, your phrase, have got to, to, to believe that the people they're voting for are actually doing them some good. Um, you, you know, it, it's difficult to, to, to um, engage and energise some young people um, because if, if they feel like there isn't anything there for them, they'll, they'll look in, in the other direction. And it's easy to be passionate about things in the abstract way, but more difficult when it's sort of tangible and, and in your own backyard. So yeah, I think it will be issue driven. Um, in the mayor election, I think that um, it's going to be fascinating because the Tories have, have chosen someone who is doesn't feel like a like a typical London candidate. Um, but it's going to be interesting because at the moment, um, Susan Hall has um, been very vocal. Uh, about ULES, um, but not about much else. Um, and lots of people think that Sadiq is, is beatable. Um, plus, we're now first past the post, so the voting architecture has changed. It's going to be a fascinating election. I think all three elections are going to be fascinating. It's a great time to be in Germany. Very, very delicate course. You've got to report news, you've got opinion, you've also got uh, a city that needs to be brought together and healed. How do you do that? It's such a huge responsibility. It is, and we, we take it very, very seriously. Our media is brilliant, but I do think that there is, um, I think there's certain elements of our media at the moment which have been very exploitative and have been encouraged uh, that kind of marginal thinking, by which I mean pushing 